Hello everyone, I hope you all are doing great. So in this video I am going to teach you how to upload your iOS app on Apple Store. And I'm gonna tell you about how to create the bundle identifier and everything, how to set up your certificates, etc. or how to generate your, you know, exec, uh, authorized access certificate. So let's start. And uh, first of all, just uh, go to your Apple developer account. If you guys don't have Apple developer account, then I suggest you to go and get your developer account. Apple will charge you $99 per year for your developer account fee. So after getting your developer account, uh, you will be able to see the screen. Uh, Apple takes like, uh, I guess, two days or three days to approve your developer account. So uh, let's just, uh, you will be able to see the, the screen once your account will be approved. First of all, we need identifiers. Okay, we are going to create the identifier. So every time you need to upload your app on store, you need... Uh, Identifier, first of all, you have to create your identifier. Identifier is something like the ID of your app. Then you need to create development certificate and distribution certificate. Then you have to register device. Then you have to make profile. So these are the steps to set up your app on store. So first of all, I'm going to just create the identifier app IDs. Next continue and yeah so description i can give the name of my app you can give any name you want so i'm just gonna say chrome dot dot file and then i'm just gonna select push notifications because my application contains push notifications functionality so this is your Identifier, bundle identifier, copy this, continue, register. An attribute is in the provider and it has invalid value. Okay, so it's not available. It's saying some app is already using this identifier. We can say iOS. Just change your name. That's all. Identifier is done. Create your certificate. Apple development certificate. Now it's saying to, uh, to manually create certificate, you need a certificate signing request CSR file from your MacBook. How to create this certificate? This, uh, see, I already have this access certificate, this one. So let me tell you how to create. Just simply open your keychain access. Okay, so you just have to, after opening this, just click this keychain access, you will be able to see this. Then certificate assistant, then request certificate from certificate authority, and then give your email or whatever you want, and then say click this save to disk and continue after that you will be able to see your certificate here on desktop or wherever you will store. So your certificate will be like this. So I have already created this certificate, so I'm not going to create again. Continue. And download your development certificate. It's very important. Then we need another certificate, Apple Distribution Certificate. Similarly, choose that same signing certificate, continue, download. Okay, so uh, I'm just going to need my Apple push certificate. If you are using push notification functionalities, you can choose this. Continue, select the Apple ID or oh, bundle identifier for your app. So this one was my bundle identifier. Continue, choose file. Same, signing certificate, upload, continue, download. 
Okay. So after that, we need your profile for our app. Click this plus button. Continue your bandana identifier, the name of your ID of your app. Select all. Continue. Select this device. You have to put one device. This device, I'm going to tell you how to add. I'm going to select all. Continue. Just give the name. I'm just going to give my app name. Generate. Okay. This one no need to download. Go back to all profiles. So for on this tab, once you will click, it will give you the same uh, option to add a device. Well, then you have to click plus sign. Uh, and then you have to type your UDID number. If you guys don't know what is UDID number, then I'm going to tell you just go to YouTube. And you can say, check how to get UDID on iPhone. So you guys can just watch this video. I will give the link uh, of this video in my description. And you can follow this. It's very easy. After getting the UDID number, you just have to go to device tab. I, I cannot open this because it's quite personal. So once after uh, clicking this tab, you can just click the plus sign on this uh, screen devices and add your UDID number and uh, give the phone name. You can say iPhone or my phone or whatever you want. And then the register. Okay. Then you will be able to see your device register. Okay. So uh, after that, uh, we are going to say like, uh, okay, things are all set up. Just go to the folder where you have downloaded your certificate and just click, double click this certificate, double click this certificate, double click this certificate. And, and we're ready to stop. Just gonna click this certificate as well because I don't know which one is. The, uh, double clicking means we need to access our certificates in keychain. So if you won't be able to see the certificate in keychain access, quit it, open it again, and you will be able to see your certificate. Like, see, this is my push certificate, this is my distribution. And once it will be stored, you won't be able to see any error while uploading the app. So this was the process of creating your certificates. So in my uh, next video, I'm going to teach you how to make a build of your app and publish on store. Okay. So uh, simply if uh, you have some experience about making the build, just click any uh, iOS device. Where is it? Where is it? Any iOS device. Product archive. Once you will click archive, it will start building your device. I'm going to show you uh, in my next video because I don't want to make this uh, video too long for you guys because it's going to be boring. So just follow the next video. Thank you.